Hey guys, welcome back. So Apple is finally removing the notch for even better looking display with the 2022 iPhone 14 Pro models. This is what we have been waiting for. And finally, Apple will be using a pill shaped hole punch cutout for the Face ID sensor. So last month we heard that Apple is finally changing the display design which actually will be a good decision in my opinion. Now with the iPhone 13 series, they definitely reduced the size of the notch but it is still making distractions on the display. So in 2022, Apple has decided to introduce a new design with addition of a pill shaped hole punch cutout without even removing the face ID sensor. According to John Prosser, this cutout will be bigger than we expected and he also shared a photo for your reference. This pill shaped design is really huge and will create same type of distractions on the display like a smaller notch is making on the iPhone 13 series. Moreover, Ross Young says that in 2023, Apple will completely ditch the notch design and will ship to dual hole punch design for all the iPhone 15 models which will be even smaller in size and more refined version of this hole punch design. But in my opinion, this cutout still looks fresh and I'm ready to accept it on the iPhone 14 Pro Max. Let me know what are your thoughts upon this in the comment section. Moving on, iPhone 14 series will offer better battery life by using 5G. Report says that TSMC will be providing 5G radio frequency chip for the iPhone 14 lineup and these chips are based on 6 nanometer fabrication. Moreover, according to TSMC, they says that this 6 nanometer process for 5G RF chips can provide a physically smaller chip with lower power consumption and to control the temperatures on these devices, Apple may likely add a vapor chamber cooling system to cool down the temperatures with power efficiency. So great news for 5G users. Further, talking about the camera setup, with the iPhone 14 Pro and Pro Max, Apple is expected to add a fresh 48 megapixel sensor as a primary shooter in the Pro models only, which will also enable 8K video recording footage on these devices, which is definitely a great move and as of now we can only imagine how well Apple can optimize this new sensor according to their taste and this is first time ever where Apple will use more than 12 megapixel sensor on its iPhones. So there you go guys these are the latest updates regarding the iPhone 14 series and let me know if you have any questions related to these smartphones. If you enjoy watching this video then do give it a thumbs up and subscribe to this channel as well. I'll catch you in the next one. Till then, peace out.